Hello, hello again, my beautiful people, and welcome to another episode of Tea and Tarot with Tanya. This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is a you versus them read. This is a general read, so it may or may not resonate with you. Take what does, leave what doesn't. I may say he, her, him, she. Those are my pronouns. I am not speaking about actual people. I am speaking about masculine and feminine energy. Put yourselves where you go in the story. If I say one side is you or your person and you feel it's the opposite, feel free to switch it. Okay? Also, if it does not resonate with you, please keep that to yourself. Keep all negative comments to yourself. It is fine. It's just not your story. Check out your, your um other signs. Moon rising or venus maybe that will resonate with you okay guys i'm trying to keep everything here positive light and love okay everybody is welcome here and if it's not your story okay it's, it's okay it's not your story um if you're new here welcome 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 if you're returning thank you guys for coming back thank you for subscribing um Please hit the little bell when you subscribe so you know when my new videos come out. And also, don't forget to hit the little thumbs up, you guys, okay? Um, the, the Zodiac sign with the most views, comments, likes, and shares at, at every end of a two-week period gets a bonus read, okay, you guys? So, that being said, let's get into your tea. Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. So we're going to do it like this. Four cards here for Sagittarius. Four cards here for Sagittarius person. Two cards in the middle for the mutual energy. Name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. So let's get into this tea, you guys. Can I get four cards for Sagittarius? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Hold on, guys. I'm back, guys. Sorry. Okay, so can I get four cards for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and how they're feeling about their person? Can I get three more cards, and I need them to jump? Can I get one more card? Can I get one more card for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and how they're feeling about their person? Oh, that's too many. Just one spirit. Oh, okay. We'll take the two. We'll leave this here crossing because I feel like that's crossing that. So now, can I get one part um, for the mutual energy? There you go. At the bottom of the deck for you guys, Sagittarius, we have the Ten of Cups here, okay? Let's see what's going on for your person. For Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. How does their person feel about them? Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus person. Feel about Sagittarius. What's going on with Sagittarius' person here? How is Sagittarius' person feeling about them? One last shuffle. Thank you very much. Name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Can I get four cards for how Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus person is feeling about them right now? Can I get two more cards for how Sagittarius? Okay, thank you very much. card for the mutual energy. Thank you. And at the bottom of the deck for your person Sagittarius is the Ace of Pentacles. Okay. Some type of offer. Okay. So let's flip this here just so I can see this is in reverse. Okay. So what I'm seeing straight off here, Sagittarius, is that you're going through some type of healing here, okay? I feel like you're guarded. You're not trying to move forward. You're, you don't want a new beginning here. You're not trying to manifest a new be beginning here. I do feel like you've been going within yourself here, and you've been working on yourself. I do possibly feel like you've been trying to heal yourself spiritually and emotionally here. I do feel like you've been listening to your intuition. Um, I feel like you've been mysterious or secretive here. With your person, I do feel like you have withdrawn and kind of went into yourself. You're trying to heal here with this star card. 
You could possibly be healing from a past um healing from a, a past emotional partnership here. It could be some type of commitment, marriage, long term commitment. I mean it doesn't necessarily have to be long term, it just could be any type of commitment here that you're healing from. And you're trying to find balance here now. Okay, you're trying to find balance and wish fulfillment, an equal give and take here after having your heart broke, okay? So I do feel like you, um, I do feel like you have just kind of went in with, within to yourself. But with this four of swords in reverse, I do feel like, um, you want to come out of that area, trying to heal from that to come out of this energy here. So let's see what's going on, Sagittarius. Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. How do they feel about their person? Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Okay, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Okay, so what is this the star for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and how they're feeling about their person? What's the star? Okay, yeah, so there was some type of lying, deception, cheating, manipulation here, okay? And I do feel like you want to heal from this, okay? You're guarded here. Um with the uh I'm sorry God you guarded with the nine of wands here. I feel like you've put yourself in this though because of past hurts, past manipulation, past people cheating. Okay, and you're trying to heal from that. I do feel like you want to heal from this. What is this seven of wands for huh? Okay. Yeah, I'm hearing that this is past I, I'm feeling like this here has nothing to do with what you're trying to heal from, has nothing to do with your person here, okay? I do feel like this is from past energies and, and you're guarded and not putting anything into this this person here because of this past situation here, okay? That's what I'm picking up. What's the seven of wands here for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? What's the seven of wands for Sagittarius? Yeah. So yeah, they're um you're guarded because of some type of commitment here, okay? Um, possibly not wanting to move forward in the commitment or guarded because of a past commitment here. Can I get one more card for the seven of wands and the four of wands? There's a lot of fire energy here, Sagittarius, okay? So I do feel like you're yeah, somebody has been stressed out, um, having sleepless nights unable to um move forward really because of this situation okay because they're guarded about this commitment or something that went wrong in this commitment lying cheating okay what is this ace of wands in reverse and the magician in reverse yeah five of wands a lot of fiery energy a lot of could have been a lot of anger a lot of hurt here okay um, I do feel like Sagittarius, this, not Sagittarius, it could be, you could be a Sagittarius. Um, oh, I am doing Sagittarius, I'm sorry. I do feel like Sagittarius, that, um, there was a lot of confusion, a lot of competition here, okay? Somebody had a lot of competition, a lot of confusion, put somebody in a lot of competition. Possibly you didn't want to move forward or you wasn't trying to manifest this situation with this person here because you had a lot of options or you had a lot of choices. Sorry, you guys, hold on for the plane. As you guys know, I stay by the airport. Okay. So, Sagittarius, you could have possibly had a lot of choices and options here, okay? And this is why you didn't want to start a, a new passionate beginning. You weren't trying to manifest a new beginning with your person here. Your person could possibly be um, a, a Pisces here, too, because of the high priestess. But you could have had a person who, who was very intuitive, someone who was connected, someone who... Who um could be into the mystical arts or those type of things here, okay? They could possibly read tarot as well. Um, but this is someone who is really connected to spirit here. And you didn't want to manifest this here, possibly because, like I said, there was a lot of confusion or there were a lot of choices and options here. Can I get one more card for this? Ace of Wands in reverse, the magician and the five of wands. 
Yeah, pay the church. But I do feel like you're still stalking this person. You're still watching this person. <laughs> you don't want to begin with them, but you don't want to let this person go here, Sagittarius, okay? And I do feel like you're stressed out about not moving forward with this person now because you had a lot of options and choices. I do feel like... Um, Yeah, I do feel like someone could possibly hurt you in the past, but I do feel like because of the hurt in the past, you're not. You're hurting this person, but not on purpose. I don't feel like it's on purpose or intentional here, but I just feel like because you couldn't move forward or you had a lot of choices and options here, you, you chose not to deal with this, this situation here, here, whoever this person is, okay? Um, what's this high priestess here for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Thank you. Yeah. Not moving forward, not making any movements, not not uh putting in any effort here, okay? Um, I I do feel like you could possibly feel bad here because you didn't you didn't put in the energy, you didn't move forward. Um and you could possibly be getting some downloads or some type of messages now because you didn't, okay? Because you didn't put the effort in and now you're realizing that you possibly should have. That could be what's stressing you out here. Yeah, you didn't move forward towards this, this emotional commitment here with this person, okay? You chose to stay to yourself here. Um, you're choosing to stay to yourself here, not moving forward, not offering anything here at this time. Okay, so Sagittarius, let's see how your person is feeling here. I do feel like your person is guarded here with this Knight of Swords, Knight of Wands. I do feel like your person feels like this could have possibly just been a sexual relationship, that you were just here to get sex. The Knight of Wands is someone who's here for a good time, not for a long time. Um, with this Six of Swords in reverse, I do feel like your person could possibly want to come back and reconcile because of the, thir the Three of Cups. Um is celebration or your person can be guarded and feel like you were just here for sex because of a third party situation here and they no longer want anything to do with you here okay as well or feel like you you didn't give them the recognition because of a third party situation here so now they're guarded <laughs> okay so what i'm getting is your person is guarded they have their guard up because they feel like you came in just for sex okay that um you didn't you didn't want them because you had a lot of choices and options here. There were third party situations going on here. So what's this night of swords for Sagittarius person and how they're feeling right now? Yeah, so um I do feel like your person is trying to manifest something new here. Um let me see. I don't know if they're trying to manifest something new back in this relationship or if they're trying to move on. Let me see. What's the magician and the knight of swords here? What's the magician and the knight of swords? Thank you, spirit. Yeah, they're trying to manifest something new here. They no longer want to be stabbed in the back. They no longer want to feel like um, they were used here or taken advantage of. Okay, with this in and out, in and out sexual energy here from this knight of wands. What is the Knight of Wands here for Sagittarius? Yep. Okay, so the Knight of Pentacles. This is someone else slow moving with stability here. Your person could possibly want to manifest something new here with you. Get past um, the past of being stabbed in the back. And they want to move forward slowly with you, okay? Building a, a stable new relationship here. They possibly could want to return. What's this Six of Swords in reverse? Oh, no, this is the... The, the king of pentacles in, in reverse. Um, they could possibly... Okay, I, I'm, I'm hearing the story now for your person, okay? Your person really wanted to manifest this relationship with you, okay? Um, but they felt stabbed in the back and they've moved on. They, they want to manifest something new now with someone who isn't going to... Um, Who isn't going to be someone who runs in and out? Someone who could bring them something stable here. They feel like, you know, you turned your back on them. You you use them is how this person is feeling right now. Yeah. The the six of wands in reverse again. Um, no recognition. No. Mm, like you you <laughs> like you came in, you hit it and ran and, and got ghosts. That's how they're feeling. Okay. Um, 
What's this three of cups here for Sagittarius' person? What's the three of cups here for Sagittarius' person? Yeah, they're really guarded here. Um, they're hurt. And they feel used. Can I get one more card? Yeah, they feel you because they were looking towards the future with you. They thought they had a new passionate beginning here with you. They thought that you guys were going to build something here. And it turned out to be a third party situation here. You weren't who you said you were. Or things didn't turn out the way they thought they were going to turn out here. Okay. So as far as the mutual energy here, I feel someone is ready to come out of um, withdrawal here. But I feel like the other person is no longer looking towards the future here with the three of wands here in reverse. Okay, they're no longer looking towards the future with this situation here. Can I, can I get two cards for the four swords in reverse and the three of wands in reverse for Sagittarius and their person mutual energy? What's the four of swords in reverse and the three of wands in reverse here? What is this three of wands in reverse in the forest to our spirit? <laughs> You're realizing now that this person was your wish fulfillment, Sagittarius. One more. <laughs> yeah, um, we have the high priestess again here, okay? So this is someone using your intuition. This is wanting to heal the situation here with the high priestess, okay? So I do feel like you want to heal the situation with this high priestess. I do feel like you feel like now that this person is your wish fulfillment here. Can I get one more card? What's this three of wands in reverse? What is the mutual energy for? Okay, so putting the work in. So I do see here that your person possibly wants to put the work in too. Um, I do feel like you guys could have a conversation here and there could be some type of um, coming together. I feel like there needs to be some honesty here. Some truth spoken here, okay? Um, but I do feel like you guys both want to still put the work in. I do feel like you guys are both still connected here. Um, I do feel like some people have gotten some clarity in the situation. And... If you come forth with some honesty, I do feel like there there could possibly be, you know, some a new a new possible possible future here, okay? A new beginning here, a new passionate, fiery beginning between you and your person and where you can celebrate here, you know, in the future. It's up to you guys, you know. Everybody has free will here. So Sagittarius, I'm going to leave this here for now. If this resonated with you, please leave a comment. Let me know. If it didn't, check out your other signs, moon, rising, okay, um, Venus as well. Those may resonate more with you. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Hit the little thumbs up button. Also, don't forget to click the bell. If you would like to book a personal or leave a donation, that information is located down below in the description box. Until next time, my Sagittarians, love, light, and peace.